Hi guys, it's Colette and Charlie from Vera B and we are still on week three of Plastic Free July so we are on skincare and we've just launched our skincare giveaway um, so we put together a great little bundle um, worth over I think it's 50 or 60 pounds worth of skincare. Yeah, I think I actually said to Colette are you sure that's the giveaway <laughs> bundle and she was like yes. Yeah. So she's been very, she's obviously in a very generous mood today. <laughs> For a Monday as yeah, well. Yeah, exactly. So. Um, so yes, so please do have a look at the giveaway. And we thought we'd come and talk um, about moisturisers today. Now we've got lots of moisturisers, so we're not going to get through them all in this um, video. Hmm. But um, I'm firstly going to talk about White Rabbit skincare. So that is vegan skincare and it's completely plastic free but the other lovely thing about um white rabbit was created by um a very clever lady called melanie and it was out of frustration for her own skin because she has very sensitive um skin and she could never find products that suited her skin she suffered with um some psoriasis um and sort of itchy irritated skin so she created this whole range um for herself really and then friends and then it just grew and it became a whole skincare collection um, and it's now all certified skincare and it really is beautiful skincare um, if you can hear noises I'm really sorry but the unit next to us are moving furniture. <laughs> it's not. It's not a dinosaur. It's not a dinosaur. Sounds a bit like a. Sounds not. like a dinosaur, but it's it not. Does. No, it sounds like a small mini dinosaur. Yeah, might might be a dinosaur. Might be. Might be. Um, um, if you see us move quickly, it is a dinosaur. Um, so, <laughs> so um, I just want to run you quickly through. Now we put a lot of time into writing all the descriptions for the skincare products. So. Always do take a look on the website if you're unsure about each product because we've, we've gone into real detail yeah. in there. Um, but very briefly, so all of the um, White Rabbit comes in uh, completely cardboard boxes and recyclable and biodegradable. And then they come in these beautiful uh, bamboo pots mm. and they're 100 millilitres so they're much bigger than a normal moisturiser so I always say you know and they also come each one comes in a little sample aluminium pot so you can sample them first and try all of them if you wanted to um, before you sort of commit to the the bigger size um, but first of all the um, rose hip and camellia um, so this is probably one of the most sort of popular ones um, because it's again, it's for sensitive skin. So if you if you need you know hydration in your skin, but you have sensitive you know if it's itchy, irritated skin, um, then the rose hip and camellia is a really really good one for you. Um, rose hip, I always go on about rose hip. It really regenerates the skin cells. Um, but there's apricot and kernel oil in there and camellia oil. So camellia oil again is really soothing for the skin. Um, there's rose water, rose and lavender oil, um, so it really calms any inf inflammation um, or irritated skin, but it's still hy really hydrating on the skin. And none of them are greasy, they're not a greasy formula. Um, the rose and frankincense um, day cream is for, the mature, is for mature skin. So um, again, yeah, you know, um, again, um, I always go on about frankincense. Frankincense is an absolutely beautiful oil for anti-aging. This, that smells amazing. Oh, Rose, yeah, it does. Smell I always think if they gave frankincense to, <laughs> to baby Jesus, then he would be happy. Yeah. Like that. <laughs> Imagine that's what, what the manger smelled like, like this. But it's, it smells gorgeous. Yeah, and it's really, um, so it helps um, the skin cell regeneration. Um, but it is really easily absorbed into the skin. And I think that's really important um, for mature skin. It's got evening primrose in there, vitamin E and avocado oil. And again, avocado oil is just full of nutrients for your skin. Um, and then, so the one that I personally use is the coconut and rose hip, even though I am 40. Um, but <laughs> it's still, you know, these, all of these really are, you know, super hydrating for the skin. And the reason I use the coconut and rose hip is because it's their calming cream. Um, and it's, it, you know, people always think problematic skin 
just means these spots and acne um, and that's you know hormonal skin but also it's irritated skin dry skin if you've got mm. itchy patches or flaky patches fla yeah flaky skin and I tend to get like um like some hyperpigmentation and stuff as well yeah and I, th I find that coconut and rosehip one is really good for that yeah because it's got it's got witch hazel in it it's got tea tree oil in it um it's got jojoba oil in it and again i go on about jojoba oil because it's really close to the own skin sebum so the skin understands jojoba oil and will absorb it very quickly um it's got cognac powder in there it's got rose hip vitamin e and lavender oil um so it's just really good and i think one thing that i did want to say about problematic skin is there's always the um kind of you want to dry the skin out because it feels oily and that is one of the worst things you can do um so because your skin will then produce more oil because it'll go oh i'm really dry and it'll produce more oil or more sebum and and obviously you want to not do that so the best thing to get your skin into a really good balance um so it's not dry and it's not oily and finding that right balance and if you have a problem with that please do message me and we'll you know i can help you find the right products to get you the right balance um but all of those come in sample packs i'll just show you my coconut and rose hip so i use mine every day um and i just wanted to kind of show you um the consistency because they're not oily at all but they just and they really really absorb quickly into the skin and they create a really perfect base if you're going to put any makeup on um Oh, they just everything she mm. makes smells absolutely beautiful but really really beautiful skincare um and i think oh the night cream i need to do night cream um so rose so they do three day creams and then a rose and orange night cream um and a night cream is important because that overnight is when your skin cells you know uh, do all of their work they regenerate um so putting on something that's going to help, obviously the winner, mm -hmm. um, yeah. and the rose and orange soothes, repairs and restores sort of elasticity to the skin. So you, I wouldn't necessarily use it until, you know, probably a, a, a specific night cream until you're sort of the other side of 35, really. You don't really need it. No. You can just use your day cream. But we do. Um, but we do, yeah. yeah. Um, and um, otherwise, we wake up like lizards, <laughs> covered in scaly skin. Um, but I just wanted to mention the the rose and orange night cream is is really good for menopausal skin as well. And um, so the rose and frankincense, but the rose and orange specifically is very good because it's really good. Again, you you know all your hormone, everything's going crazy, and. Um, it will really help soothe the skin. Um, there's mango butter in there, jojoba, flaxseed oil. So flaxseed, if you if you are menopausal, flaxseed's really good for you. Putting putting flaxseeds on your cereal and stuff, but also really good for the skin. And then is it, is it over to me? Yeah, it's over I to you. I just want to give a quick mention to our nails. Oh yeah, we did our nails. Look, these this is our new like Zao um, nail, nail varnish. varnish. Yeah, so I don't know what it's. This I love this colour. Colette got this one specially for me. I did get that one specially and what, for you. And I've got their coral, um, which I think is 656, um, coral. But they're ten, 10 free, so the 10 free chemicals that you normally have in nail varnish. They're amazing. And they are so, yeah, I couldn't believe how quickly they dry. Um, I put Great coverage two layers on. Yeah, yeah, brilliant. We love them. Anyway, we're not talking about nails no. today. We, so I just want to talk to you quickly about purities. Um, moisturizers so if you can see these guys now purity is beautiful it comes in it's plastic free obviously it comes in a glass jar with an aluminium lid and the basic thing about this is the outer packaging which is this bit comes off and this is plantable so you just plant this in some soil with some water and it grows into um, flowers and plants amazing so it's like a little extra gift yeah with your moisturizer um, so they we stock two of theirs at the moment. So we stock the Youth Glow Face Cream, which is that one, and we stock the Clear Skin Cream, which is that one. Now the Clear Skin Skin, uh, skin Cream is, as it says, it's good if you've got like problematic or yeah. sort of um, oily or spot prone skin. Um, it's got um, 
lots of antibacterial and antiseptic properties. It's got tea tree oil in it. Um, and it's also got sea buckthorn in it, mm. um, which is really good for reducing scars and redness. So this one is a great one if you've got, I would say like for a younger person with yeah, like kind of like, yeah, like kind of problematic skin that you just want to calm down. Um, and this one is, this is the one that I use, which is the Youth Glow Cream. Um, and this one's beautiful. It has got um, hibiscus flower extract in it, which has basically been named by scientists kind of like a nature's Botox, isn't yeah. it? Um, and it's also, I'm just trying to look, it's got aloe vera based, and it so it tightens and plumps skin, and it's packed with antioxidants as well, um, which is some of the things that can cause skin aging. So that's the one I use, and I recommend if you're a little bit older than 30, like me, um, you would use this one. So they are the two purity ones mm. that are on our website at the moment. Yeah, and the Youth Glow face cream has got mm. the um, Amiga oils in it as well, um, which are really good for plumping up, plumping up skin. Um, yeah, really, really, they are beautiful. But this definitely, I would say with the clear skin cream, so I use this, and I would say this is a really good cream. Um, it's not as um, kind of, as heavy as the coconut and rose hip white rabbit calming cream but I need this because I need more hydration um, in my skin um, but if you've got quite oily skin and problematic skin uh, bless you that's the dinosaur um, that's the dinosaur Just sneezing. Sneezing. Um, then the clear skin cream if you've got quite oily skin is a, is a really good one um, good one to use yeah and I think I think that's covered everything now. Yeah, I think there's quite a lot of information. And yeah. we do have, we have written a lot about each cream, but we just wanted to give you an idea of... of but you, Colette really likes answering skincare questions. She's really good at it. It's kind of your hobby in the evening. It is my hobby. It? Like answering. Yeah. So it. if you do have any, please do email us. It's um, at colletteaviraB.com. Yeah. Vera-B.com, sorry. And if you email that with any, and Colette will answer you personally. Yeah, and, and let, or Facebook. Let you know what Instagram. she thinks. Um... And then we've got another day of skincare tomorrow. Yes. And then we launch on Wednesday uh, bathroom. the bathroom, which is covering a range of products. Hair care, Hair care, care everything. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. Razors. Um, and also, don't forget, if you do order your skincare, to use the code KINDSKINCARE10. KINDSKINCARE10. Skincare one zero it's quite a difficult to say. Yeah, and you've got until midnight tomorrow night. Tomorrow night. Yeah. Yeah, to get, get your ten percent off. off your skincare products. Um so do make sure you use it because it's I think we've come, we've had such a busy day that we've been very it's there's very it's been very busy today. So yeah. just trying to think we've covered everything. But I think we have Yeah. Yeah, we'll come back tomorrow and if there's any more questions, we'll try and answer them tomorrow as well. And we will uh cover another product tomorrow maybe yep. some serums and face oils oh, yeah, and face definitely. masks we've got quite a lot of face masks so i wouldn't mind going through those just to, again we've got kind of face masks for every kind of skin um condition if you like so yes good yes okay <laughs> have a lovely evening thank you for listening thank and you. we will see you tomorrow take care guys bye bye